Path of Exile 2022 High Saviors GH here. Today we're gonna do a Path of Exile gameplay from the beginning to show you guys what it's like playing the game from the start. Path of Exile is a top down fantasy action MMORPG. And with that said, let's do this. Let's go play the game, okay guys? Here's the character creation, and here are the different characters or classes that we can choose from. First is the Templar, then we got Shadow over here, kinda looks like a clown. Then here's your typical Warrior, the Marauder, then here's the Ranger, the Duelist, and the Witch. We're gonna play as the Witch because I haven't played a magic type character here, so let's do this. Let's name our character. Okay, the Twilight Strand. And we're in the game. We're trying to stand up. And there it goes. This is what I like about PoE. They're not wasting your time. Let's do this. Okay, we can move with point and clicking. Can we move with WASD? Nope. So, okay, so point and clicking. Then we use WASD. I mean, QE, WR, ASD to use abilities. Oh, here it is. Q, W, E, R, T. And then the mouse buttons. Let's go take the quest. Dying Exile. Continue. Oh, what is this? I think he wants me to pick this up. Okay, there it goes. It's auto equip. Let's open up our bag. There it goes. We got a Driftwood Wand. Oh, wait a minute. We don't have any kind of support box. Oh, well, he got eaten. Talk this guy. Magic him up. Okay, there it goes. Fireball. Press I to view my inventory. I know I can put it here. I played this and then I got banned. <laughs> I don't know why I got banned. I think I got to 30 plus and then suddenly they banned me. <laughs> I don't know. I don't really know why. It's probably one of the apps that I have. Maybe my keyboard RGB or some of the other games that I play or maybe my recording software. They banned me two times. I think I played this 2018 and then in 2020 I played again and I got banned again. There's probably something here that I'm doing that's triggering their auto banning system. I got my second account back. They told me it's just some error, but my first one, uh, I didn't bother. <laughs> okay, anyway, that's my banning story in POE. Where are we supposed to go? I forgot. We just need to head northeast. Ooh, how do I attack here? Okay, I need to hold the control button. No, the shift. Oh, it's shift, so I can do this. Ah, uh, this feels better. What's happening? Oh, it, oh. You've taken damage. I need to use a flask one. Okay, there he goes. I want to use the fireball. What? This guy is allowing me. I need to aim, bruh. Are those spiders? No, it's a sand spitter. Okay, we don't have any more mana. Use potion. And use the mana potion. There he goes. Which is better? A basic attack or the fireball attack? More enemies. Zombies. Ooh. The sand spitter is attacking me. Let's go, bro. Let's aim. For a change. <laughs> Let's go. A corpse. I can somehow interact with it. Okay, there it goes. It gave me a shield. Now we have a shield. Let's go. Can we do anything with the shield? Oh, no. I guess it's just the defense. Uh-oh. We don't have any more mana. Let's recover it up. And here it goes. It's a dead end. Why? Uh, where am I supposed to go here? It's a dead end. Wait a minute. I think it's not loading yet. There's probably a way here. No. There's no way here. Okay, I need to go over here. Oh, okay. I went the wrong way. Oh, there's a large chest. Open it. I really like the system in this game. You can farm this gems and then put it on your equipments. It's a really good system. Well, wait a minute. What did I put at my weapon? Okay, it's a support spell. Whatever. Close this. Hunt down the zombies. We need to be careful about our mana. Because we don't have that much. I know we're gonna fight a boss here. Before we get to the first town. Uh oh, no more mana. We're stuck with basic attack. Oh, how can I 
I know there's a button over here that shows me the item that drops. I think I disabled it the last time I played. Anyway, let's do this. Finish them up. Uh oh. Let's go. <laughs> this splitter is dodging. Noise. More splitters. No speeters. <laughs> okay, we got them. Pushing up. Mana up. I think this is where the boss is. No, not yet. Ooh. Man, these speeters are annoying. They're dodging. Look at this. <laughs> They're dodging, you son of a. Actually, I kind of like it. Ooh, we leveled up. I gained the skill points. Okay, here we go again. This is one really in-depth skill system. Okay, so for some kind of a witch, we need to add... Ooh, ooh, we're getting attack. I know. Wait a minute, you son of a. Okay, let's use potion. We got an orb of transmutation. Okay, now let's put some spell damage. Apply. There we goes. More zombies. So let's go, bro. Ooh, more spitters. Okay, there goes the boss. Oh, yeah. He's the boss. Kite him. Let's go, bro. Let's go. You're just gonna die here. Stay away from me. What? Is he recovering HP? Is he? No. Okay. So how about... Let's kite him over here. Gonna die, bro. And we got him. What's this? A whetstone and a simple robe. Are we gonna change appearance when we equip that? Okay. Let's try it out. Oh, there he goes. It's already auto-equipped. So how about let's unequip it and see. What? Nothing's changing. Okay, let's equip it again. Oh, the color of the scarf. Okay. Let's proceed. Let's go to the first town, the village, Lion Eyes Watch. Let's go. And we're in the village. Give you a quest. Where's the quest? There it goes. If I remember correctly, I need to talk to all of this NPC. And then I'm gonna need to go over here. Okay, guys, before we continue on with the quest, I logged on to one of my other characters to show you guys the cash up because the cash up is not loading on a new character. So anyway, here's the cash up, guys. They're calling it Microtransaction Shop. This is gonna answer our question. Is Path of Exile pay to win? Let's go find out. And before we start over here, prices. The cash up currency in here is called points. Yeah, they didn't bother calling it whatever. They're just calling it points. 50 points is 5 USD, $5. So yeah. Now let's proceed with the microtransactions. And I think we're not gonna check out the specials, the new, so how about the stash tabs? So basically, it's in the word stash. These are all inventory spaces. You can buy extra spaces in the game. Inventory expansion for your gem, for your flask. You can store more flask, even currencies. There's all sorts of stash over here. Some people consider this as, you know, pay to win. But me, no, this is just inventory. It, it doesn't make you powerful. Well, anyway, some people think that, you know, if you have a lot of inventory, you're stronger. I don't know how, but some people do. Well, anyway, let's go to the bundles. Okay, look at this, guys. The microtransaction shop is selling skills. Skill effects, not skills. Skill effects. Look at this. Here's the scientist chaos skill bundle. And it contains different effects for the skills listed in this bundle. It's just effects, guys. There's a lot of it over here. They're also selling some skins. And of course, stash. More storage spaces because it's a real problem in here. I guess that's my only criticism in PoE. I think they made the inventory management problematic because they want to make money on it. I don't know. But I'm pretty sure they made it annoying intentionally so that you would buy some stuff in the cash shop. Well, anyway, here's the armor bundle. There's a lot of skins here. Pretty much everything in here is a skin. Let's preview this Winter Dragon Armor Pack. 
Look at this. You can buy this in the cash shop. It's just a skin, guys. Now let's move on to the back attachment. It's basically kind of like a cape. These are all skins. It only affects the way your back attachment looks. And here's the weapon skins. Let's preview one. How about this winter dragon weapon effect? Look at this. Your sword can be like that if you buy it. It's just the way it looks, guys. No stats. And here are the portals. Let's read the description. It replaces the standard effect on portals you create with the astral portal effect so basically when you're warping this will change the i know how it looks the animation the special effect so yeah more cosmetics and how it looks type of items now let's go to the skill effects okay here it goes here's the astral storm call effect replaces the standard effect on a storm call look at this skins for your spells <laughs> okay i don't mind this the game has gotta make some money now let's move on to the character tab and look at this guys more skins let's check out one here's the mercurial character effect look at this bat effects can be applied in the cosmetics tab of your inventory okay more skins and even footprints guys you can buy footprint effects in the cash shop and here's the guild tab we're not gonna check it out because you know that's not what you're looking for and here's the pets guys we can buy pets in the cash shop and there's no stats it's just a pet it's gonna follow you on your adventure in hideouts there's a hideout system in this game and you can buy a certain skin if you don't like the default hideout then how about this account features even cursors guys they're selling cursor skins in the cash shop and even the music in your hideout you can buy some in the cash shop and that's basically the cash shop i didn't see what i wanted to see to be honest with you the cash shop in my opinion is not pay to win some people may argue though that this stashes over here, the inventory expansions, may be pay to win. For me, it's not. But I've seen people argue about this, that this is pay to win. So yeah, just respect other people's opinions. But anyway, let's go proceed with the game. Okay guys, we're back. I already talked to the NPCs over here and I thought I was recording. <laughs> I wasn't. And I talked to this guy and he gave me a zombie skill. Look at this, it's the middle mouse button race zombie skill. And according to him, we're gonna need to go to the tidal islands. And I don't know how to get there, but I kinda remember it. I think it's to the southeast. We need to go to the coast. Okay, so let's do this. Oh, I need to find the medicine chest. But wait a minute. <laughs> I think I need to do that. Look at this, guys. I got the zombies. I tested it out before I recorded. I thought I was recording. <laughs> okay, anyway, let's proceed. We got zombies. They're following me. We're gonna be OP. Hey, wait a minute. Okay, there it goes. I dug them. Now I got tankers. I'm liking this. Fight. Tank for me, guys. Oh, the zombies are very useful. But wait a minute. Are they burning? Oh, they're tough. Okay. Nice. Let's go. They're strong, right? Summon a new one. Okay, I can only summon a maximum of three zombies. Wait a minute. I just said I'm gonna go southeast, but I'm going northwest. Oh, there's nothing over there. Okay, this is the only path. Let's just follow it. Let's go. Fight, guys. What's happening here? Oh, my zombies did. Someone a new zombie, bruh. Let's go. Oh, man. There's a lot of them. Let's just mob them. Mob them. This one is tough. Someone. Fight them. Let's go. We're going to the west, but we're gonna try and go to the east. If there's a path that leads 
to the east. No. And I don't remember this place anymore. Ooh, what's up? What's happening there? Somebody casted lightning spells on me. Come here, bro. I'm gonna mob you guys here. Summon. Oh, oh no. Oh, there he goes. Summon. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. I died. Man. You got me. I shouldn't have mobbed so many. Okay, anyway, I didn't expect that he's gonna cast something awesome. Okay, let's go back. Oh, look at these players, guys. I like swings. Let's open up our bag. We don't have anything new. Now let's go back to the coast. I'm assuming I already defeated the enemies over here. So we don't need to fight them again. Okay, so that fire mage is a boss. We're gonna fight him. We're gonna defeat him with summon. Okay, we got three zombies. We're gonna look for that boss. We're gonna defeat him. Oh, uh, wait a minute. I didn't go over there the last time I went through over there. Okay, over here. Let's go. Now what we need is a super AOE skill. We have a tanker now. And then just a super AOE skill. So we can easily mob in the game. Okay, I think this is where the fire mage is. Nope, he's not here. Okay, we're gonna look for him. We're gonna wreck him. Man, he's not... Okay, I think he's here. Fight! Let's go! I need to dodge. Where is he? Okay, there he goes. I'm gonna defeat you! And he's dead. Oh! No, he's not dead! Potion up! And he's defeated. We got him. Loot, loot. And that's Path of Exile from the star. I'm not gonna beat around the bush here. Path of Exile is one of the best MMORPG you can play today. It's not your traditional MMORPG, because when you're outside the hub town, it becomes instanced. And it's just you adventuring. Now, as you've seen in the gameplay, it's not great in pointing on where to go, but Google can fix that. I wish it would just point me where to go, but it is what it is. Now, the combat is one of the best things in the game where it shows how fun mobbing hordes of enemies and kiting them around. It's real fun and satisfying. Another thing that I like about PoE is how the abilities are obtained and it's through items and some are given through quests and some by just farming. It's a real fun system. Customizing your gear based on what gems you have is one of the best things in this game. But that's just me. You could hate it, but me, I love customizing in this game. All in all, if you have nothing else to play, Path of Exile should be a great free-to-play MMORPG to waste your precious time in. And if you want to check the game out, the details are on the screen. And if you like the video, hit the thumbs up, share, and then subscribe to be part of the Gaming Hardcore family. And as always, this is Gaming Hardcore. See you in the next one.